Hi viewers, this is Hamza and welcome back to my channel. Welcome to the next episode of Days Gone, guys. I hope that last episode the boss fight आपको बहुत पसंद आई होनी है और उनके लिए जिन्होंने अभी तक ये वीडियो नहीं देखी, just go in the description. मैंने एक लिंक मेंशन किया है वहाँ पे. Just click on that and watch that video. And for this episode, मैं आपको एक ऐसी चीज दिखाने वाला हूँ जिसको मैंने भी अभी तक ये गेम खेलते हुए नहीं देखा था. And I am really shocked कि मैंने वो सीन देखा and you will be shocked too. Let's find out and let's get to game. Okay, guys. Welcome to the I've next been, episode. Uh, thinking about what you were saying about doing something to make a difference around here, pay back the camp. I'm listening. Do you got a few minutes? I want to show you something. Yeah, guess I can spare you a minute or two. Is what got going to leave here? So where are we heading? You ever been out to the caves north of the lake? Okay. I know. Come on, see if you can keep up. Uh, okay, let's go. I'm talking about the cave. I got marsh duty anyway this morning. Gotta see if any freaks are stuck in the muck out that way. When's the last time you went up there? By the way, I got to see what's going on. This is your red shirt, man. Boy, we used to live in that damn cave. That old man sort of fancied He's himself a geologist. He's the one. He leader here on this camp. Sounds like we got a couple. Freaks stuck in the mud, I mean. Yeah, sounds like. Here, let me take care of them. All right. I guess I can let you do that. You have to do that? Down you go! Another bounty. Okay, nice we're done it. Schizo has just found a new man for the job. You know what Schizo can go do. Anyway, as I was saying, we spent hours talking about how all these caves were formed when lava flows would harden on the outside, but the molten cores would still flow like buried rivers. You got the big caves that drew in the tourists, like Metolius up there. There's way more than that. Riddled all over these parts. I can grab because I'm really no on bandages. Okay. अगर मैं इससे ज़्यादा दूर गया तो हमारा मिशन फेल हो जाना है सो जस्ट ओके ओके वर ट्राई टू कमिंग अप ऑन द हाईवे वी गेट बी क्वाइट बी क्वाइट दिस कैन बी ओके वी आर आउट ऑफ़ द ज़ोंबीज़ नाउ टू मेनी ऑफ़ देम जीसस क्राइस्ट this is why you brought me out here smell a bunch of goddamn freaks yeah okay okay come on follow him. wait 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 follow him where the hell are we going you'll see come on why are you chasing the hard don't get too close stay I don't, down i don't like the, oh, they are too many just look at them just look at them they are too many just what the hell are we this doesn't seem all that smart, even for a goddamn drifter. Hold up, hold up. You remember telling me about how the tourists used to flood up from California in the summer, choke off Highway 97 and the I-5 freeway? Why the hell are we doing this? Yeah. If one zombie has seen us, one zombie has seen us. One zombie has seen us. One zombie has seen us. These freaks, the big they will groups, the ones each that some call everyone. hordes. I think they're the reason we can't get their numbers down. What do you mean? Do not shoot, you idiot. Think about it, man. I've been out here in the shit collecting bounties for more just than a year. Just look at the hard. Loser two, Ricky, you had so many of them. Oh my god, just look at this one. Killed? A few. A few. Yeah, but their numbers never go down. You got a point? It's these hordes. Every night, there's a steady stream of them up and down the Sandium Highway. Thousands of freaks pouring into the Lost Lake Valley, north of the Cascades. Do you think they're coming up from California? I was closed off. No one's been south of the Centium Pass in years. It's not closed off to the hordes. Freaks are the reason it's closed off. Anyway, the point I'm trying to make 
is that the hordes come in every night. Not a goddamn thing we can do to stop them. Oh my god, there are too many. Well, you got that much right. Lost more than a few men trying to back in the day. Yeah, I know. I was there. And every horde that comes through leaves a few stragglers or gets busted up and scatters and, and just like that, freaks everywhere as far as the eye can see. What the hell they are doing? I don't know why they are chasing those... Oh, too many. You don't need to see them to know that they're Let's around. Try to sneak you Figure here. out a way to stop the hordes coming through. Maybe we can make some headway, reduce their numbers. Make it safer. Free up more farmland, irrigation. Yeah. Okay, so how do we do that? You know goddamn well you can't take on a, a, a whatever you call it, a, a horde. Okay, they are in the way. This is how. I'll be goddamn. Yeah. They stand there all day, hibernating or whatever the hell freaks do. So what are you thinking that we? Yep. Blow it the hell up. Stick it down to my there, there, and there. We bring down a mountain of rock. We seal this shit up. Yeah, so we trap a few hundred inside. What good is that gonna no, do? No, no, you don't get it. We seal this cave. Maybe they don't got no place to sleep. Or maybe this trail of piss and shit dries out, goes stale, and others stop coming. Yeah. That's a good plan. All right. All right. You get my attention. Okay, come on, let's head back. Okay. Next mission, now it's gonna be hot. Alright, my knees are warmed up a bit. Let's see if you can keep it's, up. It's... Yeah, okay. Tell me, when does being out in the shit make you an expert on freaks? You spend your spare time just following them around, seeing what makes them tick? Not exactly. And how do you know about all this? About what a horde's gonna do, where they sleep? A few days ago, I was riding north of Belknap Crater when a chopper flew by. A chopper? What the hell? Just listen to me. It was a black chopper. One of those Nero choppers that used to fly all over the goddamn place when the shit was going down. And you saw it. Like still flying. Flying. I followed him. By the way, he's one of the radios. I've been trying to track him down, see if they have a base around here. Supplies. Shit, like I see if the feds are still alive. You know what I'm saying? They're out here doing field this, work of some hole. kind on the freaks. They're studying will be them. They got resources you know, to do that while we're mission. out here starving, fighting to stay alive. I followed them up to the grotto caves. You know the ones? Yeah. They had motion sensors set up, measuring how many freaks used the cave during the day. And, uh, Mike, it was thousands. That right. They said freaks all up and down the Cascade Range, south of Crater Lake and north up to Smith Rock, all use these lava tube caves to hibernate. So, we blow up those caves. Maybe we have a few less to deal with. Hey, this idea of yours, it's got some merit, but job like that it's gonna take a fair amount of TNT he said you wanted help making Lost Lake safer this is how we do it <sighs> all right here yeah. you have to grab some TNT right. okay Look, there's some things I gotta do okay but you meet me at the bridge in a couple of minutes I know where we can find some Okay. You ready? Okay, we are ready with the iron mic now. This time you're gonna have to trust me. Okay.
So we are heading out to get some TNT. Okay, where are we going? You know what they use to mine all around these parts? Yeah, uh, mercury or something. That's right, cinnabar. The extracted mercury from cinnabar. Folks back east think it was gold mines out here and silver. Not so. Back in the early 1900s, cinnabar was worth more than gold. To operate the mine, you need TNT for expansion, blowing yeah, out new funny. tunnels, clearing cave-ins, that sort of shit. And to own TNT, you had to register with the county, keep copies of the keys to all your lockboxes with the commissioner. Wait, the county courthouse? Where the hell is that? Thought you knew. It's in the old federal building. The old federal building? The one in Sherman's camp? Jesus, Mike, what the hell? You told me... You told me that you were never setting foot in that place again. Did I? I don't recall. You were drunk right after here. Joe was Turn killed. Right here. Did I tell you this why? Okay. We are again here. If you remember, uh, from this uh, location, Mike. Uh, we the place is going to be knife. crawling. I don't, I don't think this is a that good you, idea. You went to Andy. Weather well, holes will be safe enough. All right, that there, it's the old federal building. Okay. That's where we're headed. Okay. Let's not go looking for trouble. Stay out of the buildings. Come on, we gotta head over this way. Where are we headed? Just follow me. Key will be on the commissioner. And, and you know where he is? <laughs> where his body is? Yeah, I think I do. I think... This man killed the commissioner, so that's why he knows about it. Yeah, everybody got wiped out, man, woman, and child. Only a few got out, and, and uh, you, you were one of them, right? Only two got out. Me and Nora. But it wasn't the freaks that took us out. What do you mean? Here. I hope you... You know what you're doing. I hope it's gonna be easy. I just here to Oh my god, just look at them. Oh my god. What the hell, Mike? Two weeks in. The ammo was gone. Two sides called a truce. A meeting. Right here. Oh, we knew what was coming. We knew what was coming and we were prepared. Fight didn't last long, but it was bad. It looks so bad. They had ammunition left after all, and well, they. Oh, hell, you can see what they did. Like I said, two people walked out of this town after all was said and done. And some days, I wish the hell one of them wasn't me. Do you? Commissioner's over there in the bean counter suit. Go get the key so we can get the hell out of here. Okay. Why don't you go and get them? You didn't give a damn about sealing the caves. You brought me here because you you brought me here because you wanted me to see this. Not true. All right, you got the key. We're gonna go get the maps to those mines, just like I said, and we're gonna get more than enough TNT to seal every cave in the valley. Bullshit. You are okay. right about one thing. I'm not sorry you've seen it. Not following you, Mike. I am talking about the war that's coming. With the Rippers. The one oh, that Schizo saw. So he cares how many die on either side. You don't need some zombies. Never mind. Come on. Let's get this done. Okay, we are heading for this Here's one. Here's the okay. door. 
place is locked up tight. Won't open. No, it's Come open. on. Gotta find a way upstairs. Smells like something died in here. Newts. Yeah, I smell them. Yeah. Bad business. Never much like kids. They always tended to get on my nerves. It was always the sore spot between me and my Elizabeth. God rest her soul. <laughs> you didn't like kids. Wow. In here, by the way. Dude, they don't TNT in the offices. Should be in, in some kind of armory. Okay. All right. This is oh. it. Okay, we are here to Now we got maps. maps to every mine in the county showing where they stored their dynamite. Okay, come on. You hear that? Oh, yeah. Okay. Were you expecting anyone? No. Nope. Do you have my back here? Hey, I don't like starting trouble, but I'll finish it if I have to. Okay. Here we go. Stay behind me. Hey, I can take care of myself. I'm not saying you can't, but remember the last time that we were out in the shit. Yeah, like I said, I'm staying behind you. Men coming. All of them? Right behind you. Stay down. I got this. Freaks. Bring the whole goddamn town down. There's a nest nearby. Jesus, what a mess! Now you know why no one goes into Sherman's camp. Okay, just one. Annie finds out you're out here risking your ass like this, she's gonna be pissed. Now how would she find out about something like that? Okay, get on the bike and Not get the hell out me. of here. Mess, come on. Mm. 
when we are riding back to the camp, we collect the maps of every cave so on this one. So about the Rippers, why you wanted me to see that shit? You know, Dick, I always saw a bit of myself in you, back in the day. How's well, that? Out of a fight. You don't give a shit. Oh, you care about your friend. Don't want to see him die, but me? Any other goddamn person on the planet? I don't think so. Caring will just get you killed. Yeah. That's right. Thing is, not caring will get you killed just as easy. The good folks of Sherman Camp did will stop caring about anyone but themselves and their own. Easy to kill a man when he's just some piece of meat standing between you and what you need. Schizo wants to kill Rippers because he don't think they're human anymore. They don't count. They're standing in the way of what he wants. Well, I don't buy into that shit. I won't have it. Okay, it was a hell of a mission, but we did it. We killed them and get the maps of every cave in the in the valley. So in the next mission, I think it would be a TNT. Look like the TNT you know, and go up the caves. He, uh, okay. Wonders why I'm a pacifist. That's you know, that's what he likes to call me. He uh, he thinks I'm gonna get everybody killed. Well, are you, Mike? Are you gonna get everyone killed? Freaks aren't gonna be around forever. Now, when they're gone, we're gonna need some folks around here to help pick up the pieces. Hey, look, hey, hey. I don't like Carlos and his rippers any more than I like Tucker or, or Copeland and his, his, his goddamn truthers. All right, but here, look. Here's the thing, Deke. I'm not going out of my way to kill any of them. I've had my share of killing. Even if Carlos comes for you? My truce will hold. You can bet on that. Thanks for watching till the end. I hope you are shocked now by seeing those scenes that I've shown you in this episode. There are a lot of zombies, more than 100 zombies going in a row to the cave. So in this episode, I have uh, collected one map uh, which shows a different caves. And in the next mission, I hope I probably I will collect some TNT and dynamite to blow up these uh, caves. So while blowing up those caves, I have to deal with the zombie horde. Next episode will be so much fun. Stay tuned. I'll be back with the new gameplay. See ya.